If the population continues to increase at its current rate, we will not be able to maintain or raise the global standard of living without risking the destruction of the environment. Here's a classic chart displaying exponential growth, a chart pattern that is often called a hockey stick. We are charting an amount of something over time. The only requirement for a graph to end up looking like this is that the thing being measured grows by some percentage over each increment of time. The slower the percentage rate of growth, the greater the length of time we need to chart in order to visually see this hockey stick shape. Another thing I want you to take away from this chart is that once an exponential function turns the corner, even though the percentage rate of growth might remain constant and possibly quite low, the amounts do not. They pile up faster and faster. In this particular case, you are looking at a chart of something that historically grew at less than 1% per year. It is world population, and because it is only growing at roughly 1% per year, we need to look at several thousands of years to detect this hockey stick shape. The green is history, and the red is the most recent UN projection of population growth for just the next 42 years.
Um, I want to know how you, as a woman, feel about overpopulation in the world and its relation to polluting the environment. Uh, I think how, how, how does Yoko feel about overpopulation? Oh, as a woman, I believe. Yeah. Well, I think the problem is not overpopulation as people believe to be, but it's more of the balance of things. What, you know, like food, some part of the world is wasted of food, and in some parts, you know, nobody has food. Uh, that kind of a balance, if that is solved, I don't think we would be worried so much about overpopulation. I think it's a bit of a joke the way uh, people have uh, made this overpopulation thing into a kind of myth. I don't really believe it, you know. I think whatever happens will balance itself out and work itself out. And it's all right for us all living saying, oh, well, there's enough of us, so we won't have any more. Don't let anybody else live. Mm. I don't believe in that. I think we've got enough food and money to feed everybody. And I think the natural balance, even though old people will last longer, I'm sure there's quick. enough room for us, and some of them can go to the moon anyway. You, you mean you think there's enough if it were Yeah, I don't believe overpopulation, you know. I, I think that's just a kind of myth that oh. uh, the government has thrown out to keep your mind off Vietnam and Ireland and all the important subjects. Oh, I think you're wrong about that. Oh, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah.